Jamie. All right, Jamie. Tyler. Tyler. Okay. Right on. So we'll get we'll get into it and then uh, yeah, ready when you are. Ready. Oh, we've been going, huh? A little bit. Okay. <laughs> Natural talk, you know. Yeah. You know. Okay. So we are at the Pelican booth at the Overland Expo in the Pacific Northwest, and with the new build coming up, I'm checking out some of their cases because I've got a lot of interest in this stuff for the next build. And so we're gonna walk through some of what I'm pretty familiar with, and then some of you guys' new stuff that I'm not at all familiar with yet. So. uh I'll let you go ahead and explain some of this. I am somewhat familiar with this case because we actually have one of those. That's what we store all of our camera stuff in. Nice. But um, but yeah, I'll let you walk through on some of your new options. I've never seen the Molly panels. Absolutely. Yeah, I'll just kind of start down here and move over. So, you know, we're really trying to, as always, we're focused on creating protective case products that can protect anything that you put in them, whether it's photo, video equipment, camp equipment, could be anything. But Really, for, for this off-road overlanding um, segment, it's there's a couple of really great, great products that we've shifted into that, and then added in some nice accessories that really complement that. That being, this is our 1610 case, uh, one of our protector cases that just did a quick little camp build in it. I, I actually personally use a 1650 as my camp with this exact layout, Molly panel. It's nice because you get the modular lid that you can put absolutely anything, and Molly's, you know, that's yeah. a universal system, so you're able to put whatever you need on there for, you know, it basically a grab and go camp kit. Um, and we, we make these these lids, we make for most of our popular case sizes, which is nice, so across both protector and air. And the nice thing about these, the way we design them is we, we it's called Easy Click Molly, where you can just take off these little cams. Oh, cool. And pull this thing off. And uh, the idea behind that being that, you know, depending on what you're doing, oh, I got a hidden one. Uh, this guy. But depending on what you're doing, you might have four of these in the garage. And if it's, I'm going camping today, I'm going shooting tomorrow, take off the camp one, yeah, and swap it out. And then it, they do come with these little, uh, these as well that screw into the lid bosses. So it just gives you that nice little slot it right in. So no drilling required. No drilling. That's cool. as with anything, we want to make sure that you're, uh, you're not having to drill into your case and uh, keep it right. Keep, keep it dustproof, warranty, waterproof. Keep it dustproof. Keep it waterproof. Yeah. So this one's nice. It's 1610. It's 1620. 1650. Just going up in size, but all wheeled, all just absolutely bulletproof. So really excited about this as we look at kind of the grab and go camp kit. Just keep them back your truck when you want to go. And is this one of the Pelican Airs, or is this the this original? This is not. So this is one of our uh, the Pelican Protector, the, okay. the tried and true. Yeah. Um, OG. The OG. So and as we move into, and of course, you know, those come in tons of sizes. The Pelican Air, um, same similar sizes are offered uh, for the most part. But where these are great, they're just they're up to forty percent lighter. So right. if you're hucking, you guys know, if you're hucking around a lot of camera gear that weight makes a difference um this is this this is our 1525 uh, this is our 1535 which is the same size as the 1510 which is you know the yeah. really really popular size flying with this thing full of gear makes a huge difference yeah it does um we do also make the molly panel lid for this i i actually have been testing this in my photo case and i just use tack bags put batteries and cables and all that and give that padding yeah. it's kind of nice um but these do come with foam as well We've also been using our Trek Pack. This is a huge, huge, um, this is great for photo gear. Yeah, um, that's what we got. And oh, you do? It is incredible. I, I love it. Because, yeah, it's like tomorrow, it's like, oh, I don't need the long lens, or hey, I need a longer lens. You yep. just pull that out. So, Boom. The, yeah, you can put the lens in there, you can put the drone in there, whatever exactly. you need to fit in there, you can make it. Exactly. exactly. Super quick to do. And I, I do, a lot of people are concerned about like this, the foam itself is a high density foam, but they're always worried that it's not protective enough. But the nice thing about this is you just, you cut it to hold that, you cradle that yeah. gear. So it's not bouncing around at all. It's it's snug in there. If you're so. getting dropped out of a helicopter, maybe get one of the ones where it's a foam yeah. inset for your camera. But exactly. for everything I've ever done, our camera is working right now and it's been through a lot. We, we went through Hawaii with one of these because we wanted to keep all the salt water off as we traveled. Nice. Got on a plane, did the whole thing and rented a vehicle, traveled around. These are awesome. That's awesome. Yeah, I, I love this. This is, I have one of these, I have a couple of these. I love these and just the size is nice. It's carry on so you yep. can put it above you at the plane. Yeah, it's, it's this is one of the, the tried and true for, for us. Um, and then, yeah, as far as the other camp gear, you know, we've got headlamps and flashlights. Uh, we've got coolers uh, in all different sizes from 14 quart up to 150 quart. Um, yeah. So that's we've pretty much everything you need at a campsite or to get your gear to the campsite, right. we've got it covered. 
um, which is a good segue into one of our newer products. Yep, and this is what I am, this is the newest stuff that I'm very interested in. As you can see, this thing's on a Tacoma, and that's what I'm gonna be getting soon. So I'm looking at the different case options to have this in front of the camper setup that we're gonna be building, so. Yeah. I'll let you, uh, yeah. I'll let you take over on all the details. Yeah, so the uh, cargo, Pelican cargo, this is our Gen 2. So we've made a couple of changes for Gen 2. Uh, the cases are now black. Um, made some, some changes there. And then the, the big one is the mounts. Uh, we've completely redesigned the mounts for our rooftop and saddle mount, uh, which we'll, we'll look at in a sec. But the nice thing about cargo and, and where we're really proud of it is that we use the term, you know, it's locked to loose in 14 seconds, where it's a lockable solution that you can mount to your rig and it stays there. And you can lock not only the, the case to the mount or to the roof rack itself, there's also pins up here, so all of these can be locked. So nobody's getting inside of your case, nor are they gonna take the case off. Which is awesome. It's, and it's, I, when we traveled through Mexico recently, my FJ doesn't have that many places to lock things up. Yeah. Having something like this to where, even if it's, you know, a lot of people look at this and be like, you should be carrying that weight up there. For us, we're probably gonna carry clothes up here, but if we go into a restaurant somewhere in a foreign country, we can put like the laptops in here just while we're inside eating or something, yeah. lock it away, and then we don't have to worry about it. That's sure, especially, yeah, high quality lock through here. You can do both. Each one, each mount has a locking area, right. so you can create a pretty big headache yeah. for anybody. <laughs> for the, sure. the opportunistic people are not gonna be coming for this. Yeah. Um, and then, yeah, with the product itself, it's uh, now held in by two pins, so when you're ready, Either you want to take it out, put it in your garage because you're going to daily the truck for the week or you want to, you know, put gear in it. You just pull these two pins and then the case itself comes right off. That's pretty sweet. So, you know, do what you need to do, get back on and then uh, there's two little receivers in the back that hook in. You slot it in and you put the case back on, you lock it up and drive off. That's awesome. So yeah, we're, we're really, really excited about it. I use, uh, this is our BX90R, so this is the medium size. We, uh, we have a large size, it's on the tailgate, the BX140, that's what I use that on my Land Cruiser. I leave it up full time. I, you know, I live and work out at our uh, Torrance facility. I, I don't worry about it, I'll go to eat, leave it anywhere, I don't worry about it, it's locked up. Um, and it, it's great to have that storage up there. Yeah, definitely. So the other solution we've got, what, four different mounting solutions. So we've got rooftop, uh, we have a saddle mount, which kind of mounts on the bed sides. We have a side mount, which is takes our smaller cases and kind of puts them back towards the tailgate. Right. And then a cross bed mount. So that'll mount against your cab um, and kind of be suspended. So, and those cases are huge. So that's, you can fit just about anything in right. those. So it kind of takes a lightweight, the traditional toolbox, but it's a lighter weight version of that's that. That's exactly like it. I equate it to, yeah, those construction toolboxes that you see in the back of trucks today, they're like diamond plate. Yeah. It's it's basically a replacement for that. It's, it's a little lighter, so. Yeah, can we check these things out? Absolutely. So yeah, back here, um, this is our 140R. We, we just kept it down so that people could use it and see it. But um, yeah, on the inside, again, it's a ton of space. Um, we do have a tongue and groove here, so it is weather resistant. Um, and then there's a, a rubber seal as well to, to fully seal this thing off. So you don't have to worry about driving through rain or any inclement weather, dust, this thing's sealed up and, and it'll keep the content safe. What I really like about this is that you guys don't have overly thick walls on this because yeah. it's gonna be plenty, it's gonna be plenty secure in here. And I like that this space isn't wasted. I've seen that on other cases and I do not like that. Yeah. It's adding weight and it's just taking up space. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And the, the strength is there, but you still get, yeah, you get that space that's fully usable. Like that comes in handy. Um, and, you know, coming out in the, the coming months, we'll start accessorizing on these or you'll start seeing gas struts and molly panel lid cool. accessories, et cetera, to really make sure that this becomes a, an extensible ecosystem. Okay. And then are you guys going to be doing, I assume, lid mounts and stuff like that too? That's the plan. Okay. Yeah, cool. that's absolutely the plan because that, that's, this is great space to use for yep. all the little stuff or, you know, whatever you need. So that's, that's part of the roadmap, but, uh, yeah, we're, just, we're really excited about this. And then behind it, we've got the, the saddle mount case. Uh, that's our BX55S. Um, so similar premise where, you know, it's locked to loose. Up there. Um, same thing as the rooftop mounts where it's just held in by the two pins. So you can yank these out, tilt it, remove it. And then you've got the, uh, this is how the saddle mount works. This is on the Toyota system. So we use their rail here, but we do make a universal that actually just hooks into the bed flange. And, uh, and mounts that way. So we have multiple applications. Um, and then when you're done, and you know, let's say you need the bed space, um, you can just take that out 
There we go. And then these fold up. That's cool. So it's nice. Uh, you know, it does stick out above, but if you need that bed space to go haul something from Home Depot, you've got the space and, you know, you can, uh, it's, it's extensible in that yeah. way, which is really nice. And so, we were yeah. talking a little bit before we started recording and uh, he's not entirely sure, but I assume with like a go fast camper and Alucab, cab, if you don't want to pay for the whole goose gear system, you can probably get something like that as long as these brackets will fit in that location. So then you could have potentially, I would assume that this can hold up the weight of a person. So you kind of have a bench or if you're taking it out and using it as a step to get into your truck, that can go on the ground and now you have that fold these up and then it's out of your way so it's pretty it's pretty cool yeah and it's a and it looks like a very lightweight option compared to some of the other options out there yeah yeah this thing i mean this this doesn't add much weight at all and then the case itself especially these the 55 and the 85 are, are made for the saddle mount although you can rooftop mount this specific the bx55 can rooftop mount um i mean with the handle carry i, I carried it in from the parking yeah. lot you know with gear in there it gets a little heavy but as a standalone solution, it's it's really reasonable. And yeah, when you put it back in, you just get it in those feet, slot it in, and it's it's that's, back in. That's pretty cool. Yeah, let's see that fully in. <laughs> they get pretty heavy, but when you fill them up with stuff, but at the same time, you're usually only moving from there to there, exactly. grab, grabbing your stuff, putting it back. If if you're even taking it down, some people won't even take them down off the roof. Yeah, so. yeah. I leave mine. This, like I said, this stays on full time. I reach in and grab what I need get off and these are uv treated yes sir yeah yeah so. yeah absolutely these are designed to just sit out and sit on your truck sit on top and awesome. uh be in the elements so yeah they're good looking cases thank you yeah we're, we're really excited about it. this is a, an exciting new category for pelican where you know we're well known for the gun cases the photo cases you know the protector of the airs um this is a whole new thing for us but it's there's just so much potential here okay. and and uh yeah we're we're really excited about it and again you have this size you have one that goes up here you have this one right here and then how many more sizes were there so we've got the three here and then there's five more so oh, there's basically cool. two sizes per mounting solution so two, two and it's always a medium and a large so uh this being the large rooftop medium rooftop uh medium saddle we've got a large saddle and then uh same for the cross bed and the side mount okay so, Awesome, man. A lot yeah. of different options. These are great. Thank you. Thank you. All right. So uh, if you guys want any more information on these, they can reach out to, I guess, just pelican.com. Yeah, pelican.com. Uh, they'll be available online uh, hopefully around early September. We'll be launching. And uh, yeah, and the mounts will be available as well for purchase. So, um, and everything else you saw here, all available on pelican.com. Definitely. Okay. Yeah. Looking good. Good job, guys. Thank you. Right on. Cool. All right. Thanks for your time. Dude, absolutely. As always, thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe if you haven't already, and feel free to check out my other adventure, off-road, and overland-related content.